The purpose of this short video is to share the do's and don'ts of caring for your Steelcase wood furniture to keep it in the best condition and to provide years of satisfying ownership and use. Each of our wood products is shipped with a booklet that highlights what we'll review in this video. Each piece of wood furniture is one of a kind. Each tree is unique and has variations in color and grain pattern. Because of the characteristics of each piece of wood, you may notice a difference in adjoining pieces by the way that light reflects. This is part of the individuality and beauty of wood. At Steelcase, we take great pride in our wood furniture. Our wood plant is the world's first LEED certified manufacturing facility. Many of our products are cradle to cradle certified. And Clarity Waterborne UV Clear Coat Finish provides exceptional durability and quality while helping to protect the environment. Even with the top coat, wood is vulnerable to outside factors far more than other materials like steel or glass. Let's get started with how to care for your wood furniture. It's important that you know the best ways to protect the furniture in your offices from the environment. Wood responds to variations in heat and humidity. For best results, maintain humidity levels between 30 and 50 percent and temperatures between 60 and 80 degrees Fahrenheit. Exposure to light also affects the aging of wood. Periodically, move work tools and other objects on top of the furniture to ensure even aging. Light and air cause wood colors to change slightly over time. This is especially apparent with cherry, which darkens and matures quickly. Keep your wood furniture away from direct sunlight, if possible, to preserve its original beauty. Let's talk about how to interact with your wood furniture. If you think of how you treat your mother's furniture, the same ideas apply. Be sure to lift objects when moving them. Dragging or pushing them across the surface can lead to scratches in the surface. Use felt or leather pads on the bottom of stationary objects, such as a light, to protect the finish. Over time, rubber, plastic, and vinyl can damage the finish. Use a coaster to protect the finish from dents and scratches from mugs and glasses, as well as the moisture from hot and cold liquids. When writing on the surface of the desk, consider the following options to prevent dents and scratches. Use felt or leather pads with a protective top. The pads lift the top slightly and allow the wood to breathe. If there is no desk pad on the surface, an easy way to prevent scratches is to write with several sheets of paper underneath to prevent dents. The same idea applies to vinyl binders. Prolonged direct contact with wood shelves or surfaces can eventually damage the finish. Be sure to change the placement of the binders from time to time. The arms and back on the user's chair can also rub or bump into the woodwork surface. Whether while in use or stowed away, take care to lower the arms of the chair to avoid interference with the edge of the work surface. If there is a monitor arm, take care that the screen doesn't touch the work surface to avoid scratches and dents. Avoid tossing items on the work surface. Take care not to kick the base of the furniture or damage may result. In addition, for any object, there are limits to what weight it can hold. This is true for wall-mounted overheads too. There is a weight limit. With a 60-inch wide version of a wall-mounted overhead, the total weight allowed is the following. Inside weight limit, 155 pounds. Top of the overhead weight limit, 180 pounds. The total weight limit is 335 pounds. Remember that wood is organic and cannot take the same wear and tear as steel or plastic. Here are some cleaning hints. Clean up accidental spills immediately with a soft, absorbent cloth. Wipe the same area with the dry cloth and wipe in the direction of the grain to remove fingerprints and dirt. In addition to the environment and daily use, proper cleaning and maintenance is a must. Let's talk first about daily dusting. Clean with a slightly damp, soft cloth. Use another soft cloth to dry. Remember to wipe in the direction of the wood grain. For monthly cleaning, the following steps are recommended. Clean the surface with a quality cleaner or flax soap formulated for wood furniture. Follow the manufacturer's directions for proper dilution. Dampen the soft cloth in the diluted solution and wipe in the direction of the grain to remove fingerprints and dirt. Wipe the same area with the dry cloth. 
Oils and ammonia should never be used on wood furniture. A quality spray wax may be used once or twice a year. Avoid more frequent use as it can lead to a sticky wax buildup. For cleaning hardware, use a non-abrasive metal cleaner. Apply the solution sparingly. It must not come in contact with the wood. Wipe the hardware clean with a soft cloth. You can also contact your facilities department, local Steelcase dealer, or Steelcase Line 1 with questions on care and cleaning. Finally, for the occasional repair issue, contact your facilities department or your local Steelcase dealer. Often, as a natural material, wood can be repaired. Information on the topics shown in this video and for many other wood care and use questions can be found at www.steelcase.com. Check under the Products tab for individual product information. By following these simple reminders and treating your office furniture as if it were your home office, you'll enjoy the beauty of your Steelcase wood products for years to come.